Hector, welcome back, Hector. Sorry, I drive in, in this moment. That that's okay, right? Drive drive, drive safely, okay. Uh, Where were you for? Yeah, I haven't seen you around. What what happened? Um, more work. I went to. I go to. No, I went to Santa Ana City. Oh really? What did you do there? Vamos a poner luz. A ver si me ven. Yes, we can see you. Okay. I tried. So what what do you do there? What do you do in Santana? For work, meeting in La Pampa, Argentina. Oh, nice. Is it is it a good place? Do you think that I, that's I, a good place I, to eat? I work to bread. You work what? Bread. Uh, panaderia. Oh, okay. In my in my work, um, distribution to food, food and, and drink. Vines and liquor. Okay, that's great. That's great, man. That's actually very interesting. Okay. Uh, Stephanie, how are you, Stephanie? Good to see you. How was your day? Uh, good evening. Good evening. I had a good day. And you? I had a, I had a good day too, actually wasn't too stressful but i think it's because it's thursday you know yes. um but yeah I, I want i don't think i'll go out i don't think i'll go out uh on friday because because my mom is at the hospital so i i'll go you know i'll try to visit her your mom is sick yes yes she uh what happened it has been super complicated uh it's it was it there's a how do you um she had an issue with with the uh gallbladder the gallbladder is is um vesicula you know uh. so, yeah but but it was like it, it's really bad it's just she's still there you know um so anyways um all right, guys, I wanted to ask you, uh, how are you doing with the platform? I finished the platform. You finished? You finished? Uh, did you finish the exam? Did you get 100? Yes. Yes. All right, that's great. Okay. So, guys, today we are going to talk about expectations, okay? And uh, we have a pizza party, too, for, uh, sponsored by Hector. Hector had not come to class because he was getting the pizzas. Por eso no había venido Héctor, porque nos tenía preparado una pizza party. Dijo que en el último día, dijo que en el último día, right, nos iba a sorprender con un montón de pizzas aquí, right? So, <laughs> I'm kidding, guys. Right, very good. Uh, but nice to see you, Héctor, okay? It's good to have you back, man. All right. I have a, I have a one bottle of wine. Yeah. Oh, you have a bottle of wine? Uh -huh. Bring it over, man, all right? I'm waiting for it's it. A, it's a red blend. Nice, nice, nice. I it's like very delicious. <laughs> I, I like red wine. I really like red wine. Very good. That's great, man. That's great. Okay, guys, so. Uh, I miss wine. Do you, you like you? it? I miss wine. She misses it. Yes. So she, she she likes it, right? She likes it. Very good, guys. So we're gonna talk about expectations today, okay? Now, um, what's an expectation, guys? Nancy, welcome, Nancy. Nice to see you. Hi. So, what's an expectation? Something that you are waiting for, something that 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 you expect, right? Something that that uh, is supposed to happen, right? That's an expectation. 
So today, guys, we're gonna go over you know expectations and we're gonna have some practice at the end. Okay. So let's read the objective. Jose, could you please help me read the objective for today? In this class, you will learn how to use clauses with when and if for expectation. Very good. Okay, so clauses for with when and if for expectations. Okay. All right. So let's have a small warm up. Okay. So tell me, guys, here in El Salvador, what's a custom? Okay, let's 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 read it. Um, who'd like to help me read, guys? Give me a What is the the custom when you visit to in your country? All right. What's the custom when you visit someone in your country? What is the custom when you visit someone in your country? Okay. Then the answer can be. What can the answer be, guys? When you visit someone, repeat, guys. When you visit someone, it's the custom. To... Everybody, repeat. Let's go. So, when you visit someone, when you visit someone, someone, it's the custom to. It is the custom to. All right. Is the custom to what? So I'll give you an example, guys. To buy pupusa for dinner. Okay. To buy. Okay. Very good. Okay. To we can say. To, we can say to buy pupusas for dinner. Very good. See? So, so I like your example. Uh, good job. Uh, Hector. So, I'm sorry, Hector is driving, guys, so I might not ask him. <laughs> you can. All right, very good. Uh, Stephanie, right? Stephanie, right? So, what's a custom when you visit someone here in El um. Salvador? To buy a coffee. To buy, to, okay, to buy coffee. All right, well, what do you think, Hector? What, what's a custom when you visit someone here in El Salvador? Uh, to buy um, a hammock. To buy a, to buy a hammock? Um, hammock? Hey, a Ari. Maca. To buy a hammock? <laughs> Comprar una yes. maca. Cuando visitas a alguien, compra, le compras una maca. It's typical. Really? No. Visit It's me, typical. man, because I, have, I, I didn't know that, right? Visitame y me da una maca, right? It's It's not, right? Give me half. It's okay. A It's, It's a gift for what? Nostalgic. A nostalgic. Yes. It's All a right. gift. Nostalgic. To... nostalgic gift. Okay. Let me, right, I'll give you another example, to... guys. It's yes, the Jose. custom to bring. bring it's the custom to bring. The, okay. Uh, bring what? Uh, someone eat. Someone to eat? Uh huh. Hold on. When you visit someone here, someone here in El Salvador, you bring someone along with you so they can eat. Yes. I, I, I just don't want to candy. So <laughs> Although, I, I don't know, I don't know if you know what you're trying to say. Okay, what you're telling me is que cuando visitas a alguien aquí en El Salvador, llevas a alguien con vos para que coman en la casa de la persona que está visitando. No, llevo algo para comer. Okay, I bring. Okay, so listen, I bring something to eat. Something, not someone, something, okay? Got uh, it? Okay, something. Something, okay? Write it down okay. in your notebook, something to it, okay? Very good. Uh, what about you, Laura? What do you think? I um, I said... Uh, uh, when you visit another, someone... Another example. Ah, okay. When you visit someone, it's custom to bring something for their, the family. For what? Oh, for the family? Uh-huh. Okay. Very good. Maybe fruit or I don't know. All right. Very good. A Horchata. Okay, very good. Catherine, what do you think, Catherine? Semita. <laughs> Semita. Oh, Catherine, I think your microphone is not working. Okay, guys. So good answers, guys. Good answers. Okay. Uh, Nancy, what do you think, Nancy? Uh, to buy a souvenir. Okay, to buy a souvenir. 
How do you spell souvenir, guys? Like, like this, right? To buy a souvenir. Okay. Good job, guys. So, when you visit someone, you're forgetting a lot of things, guys. Here in El Salvador, I have never seen the things that I have never. Oh, who's within my computer? Nancy. How are, how are you within my computer? Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, hold on, hold on. Wow, okay, hold on. I'm going to stop sharing. <laughs> How do you have access to my computer? <laughs> Nancy, I love any hacker, you know? All right, very good. All right, so. <laughs> so, anyways, guys. So, uh, I, I forgot what I was telling you guys. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. Guys, I have never seen everything that you told me, guys. I have never seen that. Nunca he visto todo lo que me han dicho, guys. Nunca he visto que pase cuando visita a alguien, okay? But I have, I have seen this, okay? When you visit someone in El Salvador, it's the custom to call first. Yes or no, guys? You're supposed to call first, right? All right. What else, okay? Uh, you're supposed to be polite, right? Yes? You're supposed to um, to behave well, right? Comportate bien, right? You're supposed to steal things from their house, yes? Ah, that's just, that's just a pango, right? No, I'm kidding, guys, right? If you're from Soya, guys, I'm sorry. Hey, ¿qué tiene contra los de Soya? All right, very good, guys. Very good. Okay, <laughs> just kidding. All right, very good, guys. So that is that is the custom, right? That is the custom. All right, guys. So, so uh, let's see, Hector. No, not Hector, guys, because Hector is driving. All right, I don't want you to read. Uh, Stephanie, help me read. Stephanie. Sorry. That's okay. That's okay. Okay. Expectations. When you visit someone, it's the custom to bring a small gift. Okay, very good, okay. So I want you to take a look, guys, at the structure, okay? Because we're gonna go over the structure soon, okay? All right, next, okay, uh, Nancy, could you please help me read, Nancy? When you visit someone, you are supposed to arrive early. To arrive, repeat, arrive early. Arrive early. Okay, you're supposed to arrive early, okay? All right, very good, guys. So uh, let's bring up the whiteboard here, okay? So um, so let's talk, guys. Let's talk about expectations, okay? So an expectation, guys, what, what's an expectation? Something like hope. Okay, it's it's like what you know what we something we wait for, right? Something that we wait for. Algo que nosotros esperamos, yes. So expectations, guys, is you know what we wait for, right? Very good. So guys, within expectations, we have, we have this, okay? Which is customs, okay? And what's, uh, um, let me ask you. So what's a custom? What's a custom, guys? Something that is traditional to happen. Okay, all right. So, custom guys, is a okay. So we can say, you know, perhaps that's a tradition. All right, tradition. What else? So, custom guys, it's you know what people or what cities right what people in cities 
are exp no hold on how people <coughs> are expected to behave within a city or country right so this is a customary guys okay your how you're expected to behave okay so far so good all right very good guys so now how can we talk about customs okay and this is the structure i want you guys to write down the structure of a custom okay all right so we're gonna go with all right the you can either use guys when or you can use if okay got it when plus if all right now remember yesterday guys we learned about first conditions right so what comes next guys simple present okay so simple present right so we're gonna go with we're gonna go with uh went off uh, subject, right? Plus what else? Mm -hmm. What else guys, what else comes after the subject? Simple present verb. Okay, verb in base form. We're gonna say BB guys, verb BB, okay? Base BF, I'm sorry, BF means base form, okay? All right, so verb in base form, then what else? Compliment, right? Compliment. Okay, so we got the compliment here. So. So when you visit someone, okay, for example, when you visit someone, right? Now here, guys, do not forget to add a comma, right? So there needs to be a comma here. Remember? Right? So you're going to use a comma there. All right. And then, guys, you are going to use, guys, these phrases. However, I'm going to give you the structure, the structure instead, okay? So you can use... So you can use... Um, you or a subject right okay all right now you're gonna use after this guys you're gonna use the verb b guys okay so you're gonna use here the verb b in past participle okay the verb b guys in past participle okay all right, this step, guys, is very important to remember. All right, you're gonna use the verb being past participle. All right, so you, right? I'm sorry, no, 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 I'm, I'm sorry, guys. Okay, you're gonna use the verb be here, guys, I'm sorry. And then you're gonna use past participle, okay? All right, I made a small mistake there. So verb be plus, okay, and then here, a verb, any verb, okay, verb in, past participle all right then you are going to use then you're going to use here guys all right uh, oh my god we have we ran out of space all right so here you're going to use an infinitive do we know what, do we remember guys what an infinitive is? ING? No. An infinitive guys is two plus a verb in base form. Got it? That is ING, that is an infinitive guys, okay? Two plus the verb, okay? And then after this guys, finally, <clears throat> you're gonna use 
you are supposed to bring, okay, and then, you know, you're going to use an object, okay? All right, so you're, gonna, you're supposed to bring food or whatever, okay? So this is the structure, guys, for expectations, okay? All right, take a screenshot, guys, send it to the WhatsApp group, okay, write it down, okay? But we have to work with this, okay? So now, guys, I'm going to give you examples, and then you are going to give me examples, all right? So for example, Let's think about examples here. All right. So first thing that you have to do to use, guys, is when, right, or if. So let's use when. When. Give me a subject, guys. It could be any subject. When I go home. When I go I running. Running. All right. When I go running, uh-huh. Coma. I. I. B. No. Uh -huh. I. I. Uh -huh. uh -huh. um, I don't know. You don't know what's the uh, conjugation for the verb B with the pronoun I? No, I is subject. And yes. I am. I am very good. Ten, past, here, guys. Participle. Here in past participle, okay, you can say I am expected, I am supposed, uh, I am, uh, I am not expected, right? Or I am not supposed. Okay, so you can use negatives if you want to, right? I am uh suggested you know or he's he's recommended i am it is you can say it is you know it is recommended okay so all right so you can use these okay you can use these phrases in past participle right let's go so when i go running i am i don't know you, you can use, okay, Jose, you can use expected, supposed, not expected, it is recommended. Instead of I am, you know, it is recommended, right? So, so I am what? Expected. All right, I am expected. What comes next, guys? Thank you, Jose, all right? Don't worry, we'll try later, okay? What comes next, guys? Who? I am expected to, right? To what? To run. I am expected to to to, to run. To where? To drink water. Or to drink water, okay? To drink water. All right. Or to wear a handkerchief. Do you know what a handkerchief is? No. All right. A handkerchief is something that you clean your face with when you are sweating. Men do not wear handkerchiefs anymore. Do you get it? Do you understand what a handkerchief is? A handkerchief? Okay. Men Toyita. used to wear, ex yeah. Uh, uh -huh. Por limpiarse uh, la pañuelo, cara. pañuelo, guys, okay? Pañuelo, ah, exactly, okay. pañuelo. Okay, very good. All right, so. I don't think anybody wears a handkerchief, a handkerchief anymore. All right, very good. Uh, when I go running, I'm expected to wear a handkerchief or to drink water, very good. All right, do me a favor, guys. I want everybody, guys, to send me examples. Necesito que todos en el chat me envíen un ejemplo, guys. I actually, actually, send me three examples. Que todo el mundo envíe tres ejemplos en el chat as I ask you, okay? Mientras les pregunto, guys, envíenme tres ejemplos, okay? Stephanie, right? Let's start. No, actually, Laura, let's start with you, Laura. Right? Give me two examples. Let's let's use uh, if, right? Let's use if. Let's use an if clause. Laura? I think you're muted. 
me. Yes, yes, Laura, yes. So give me if two examples. She dance, uh, if she what? Okay. If she if she if she dance, dance. so hard. If she dance. Dance. Uh -huh. If she are so you hard? sure? So you say so you say I dance, you dance, she dance. Is that how we say it? No, I mean she dance. You're saying the same if thing. She, no, if she dance. You're saying the same thing if she dance. Guys? Yeah, but this if subject verb based form. Yes, guys. What do we do when it is third dance. person, guys? Dances. Mm -hmm. If she dances. Uh, okay. I was trying to say I said dance, but I, I know I now I know it's dances. Yeah. Okay, very good. Right, she dances. If she dances so hard, she if she, no if she dances widely, right? right okay. Widely, yes. Right, you don't say <laughs> you don't say hard. If she dances okay. widely, okay, right? If she dances wildly, wildly, she. Okay. So if she dances wide, widely, I think your connection is cutting off, Laura. Yeah, I think. Wait, I need to move. Okay. I'm not in my house, sorry. Oh, okay, that's okay. All right, don't worry. Hey, todo de my guys, necesito que me envíes su ejemplos, okay? All right, very good. Okay. If she dances wildly, dances. She, she dances wildly, she. So much she, huh? She is, I'm not sure, be, verb be in present or, or how? In the present, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. You're good. So far, everything is good. If she dances widely, she is. She, dance, she is got too tired. She, okay, no. She is, you can use she's expected. She is supposed, the words they used above, right? She is uh, not expected. Uh, okay, so wait. I I am confused in this part. Yes. You say subject plus plus B, verb B. Yes. Right? Plus verb in past participle. Yes. When you say past participle, it's, it's like past simple, right? Yes. Or not? Uh -huh. Yes, uh-huh. Exactly. And we use just that for uh, the verbs you grow, expect, suppose, not expect, is recommended, the, or the, we can use other verbs. You can use other verbs that are similar to this. That's why I said past participle and not, I, I didn't give you just, just this, right? You can use some other verbs, but not all verbs, all right? You have why? to, because you have to use verbs for expectations, all right? Whatever verb is, expectations you know for expectations so if you say she is song okay does it she is supposed exactly she is supposed to get tired to get tired very good very good okay so if she dances widely right she's supposed to get tired that is perfect okay now the reason why that that was a good question by the way the reason why you don't use you don't say that guys is because all right because guys, she if you say she's song to get tired, okay, that doesn't make sense, okay? Ella es canto, right? That doesn't make sense, okay? All right, she's supposed to get tired, okay? Very good. Uh, good job, Laura. Give me another one. Laura, give me another one. I think not everybody's okay. done. Um, when you finish, The recipe. Uh -huh. I am supposed to eat it. Very good. Okay, eat it. Good job. Okay, I am supposed to eat it. Good job. Awesome job. Plus for Laura, guys. Good job, Laura. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Hey, what happened to everybody else? 
I had Hector and I had Catherine. <laughs> I think they lost connection. All right. Uh, Stephanie, all right. Give me your example, Stephanie. Okay. And when, when he takes a shower, uh -huh. he is expected. He is ex expected. Uh, he is expected. Uh -huh. To more awake in the morning. To be more uh, to awake be. in the morning. Okay. Good job. All right. Uh, give me another one. And if she. If Dua Lipa, huh? Thanks. Thanks. Um, she is. She is, uh huh? Expected. Okay. So if Dua Lipa sings. She is expected uh, to hmm, to impress in, to the public. To impress, impress. the public. Mm -hmm. Good job. Okay. To impress the audience. Okay. The oh, audience. Okay. okay. So if Dua Lipa sings, she is expected to impress the audience. All right. Or you can say, if Dua Lipa sings, you know, men are supposed to vow. So they're supposed to go like this, right? <laughs> All right, very good. Good job. Uh, uh, Jose, give me your example, Jose. When they sing a song, I am supposed to sing well. Supposed to saying well good job perfect uh you can say i'm expected right too right let's use expected let's not use suppose anymore guys let's use it is recommended or you know uh expected or not expected okay jose give me another one when i drive a truck i uh, uh -huh. expected Okay, when, yeah. right? So when I drive a truck. When I drive a truck. I am I, expected. I am expected. Huh? Everything else is okay. I am and, expected <laughs> to be okay. Que el carro esté bien. Okay, so, so now, what is this, guys, if we say, if we're gonna talk about the car, which is gonna be the which is gonna be the subject, me or the car? Drive, I drive. No, when I drive the truck, are you gonna talk about the car or are you gonna talk about you? No, the car. Okay, when I drive a truck, the truck, you can say it, right? Because you're talking about the truck, okay? When I drive a truck, it is supposed, right? Or you can say the truck again if you want. The truck is supposed to be okay. Got it? Okay. Huh? Okay. All right. Yes, Very good. Man. Very good. Okay. Good job. Uh, and lastly, Nancy, right? Lastly, Nancy, give me your example, Nancy. Okay. Uh, when you visit, the family when you visit the family you are supposed to you are speak. supposed to speak okay very good beautiful okay give me your other example nancy okay. when they uh, viajar when when they viajar that doesn't exist via, no como se dice viajar how do you say viajar? travel travel okay yes when they are traveling now, when they travel, they are expected. They're expected. The visit. To visit. To visit a uh, muchos lugares, much more. Many places. Okay, very good. Many good job. Places, okay. All right. Very good, guys. Very good. Okay, good job. Thank you, guys. Okay. 
All right, guys. So, uh, did we get it, guys? All right. Vodka Petrov clear or <laughs> coffee from Starbucks clear? <laughs> All right, very good. All right, guys. Uh, all right let's i have some exercises for you guys i'm gonna send you uh, i'm gonna send something to the whatsapp group guys there are two things there okay the first is the first thing that you're gonna see there is something that you have to complete okay so you have to fill out what you see there okay so like this hold on i'll show you soon guys let me send it first Send it first. All right. Hold on, guys. Intermediate. So that's the first one. This is the second one. All right, and that's it. Okay. So in the first exercise that you see there, guys, you're gonna fill out the complement. Okay. So the the second part. All right. That's where you're gonna fill out. Okay. So for example, okay, let me show it here. For example, right, you can say whatever you want here. If you plan to visit someone at home, you are expected to take off your shoes. I don't know, if you live in Korea, guys, that's I think that's what they do, right? Okay, but you can say whatever you want, guys, okay? Whatever you want. Yes? Okay, so lo que quiero decir que aquí me lo llenen con lo que sea que ustedes se lo ocurra, right? So whatever you, you, you know, you, you, uh, come out with and in the second part guys in la segunda parte okay this is an oral conversation so what are you expected to do when you go on a first date i would say i don't know because i have never been on a date see all right so en la segunda vas a hablar right que se supone que harías cuando right vas en una primera cita right yo te digo no sé porque yo nunca he tenido una cita right I don't know. Whatever you want to answer here, guys. Okay, as long as you, as you talk, got it? Yes, guys. All right, very good. Super good job, guys. Let's go. Welcome, Ruben. Nice seeing you again. All right, let's get together, guys, and work on this. Hi, Stephanie. Hello. Okay. Really? Hi, okay. Um... The first one is if you plan to visit someone at home. Uh huh. Um, I am. I am. I, uh -huh. I am. Uh -huh. Así es. Sí. sí. Yes. Expected. Expected. 
to drink water. <laughs> no. Uh, when I eat, someone I expect. Ofrecer algo. Uh -huh. Offer something. Algo de tomar. Offer something. So, Offer Pero, something. Offer something to me to drink, maybe. David to is drink, the correct form. To drink. Uh, no, to say, drink. say it again, because I'm not. I, I got confused now. I don't know what you're trying to say. If you plan to visit someone at home, I expected to offer, offer something to drink something. to me. All right. The, the thing is that who is going to give. You have to remember that the subject is the one who performs the action, okay? The subject is the one who performs the action, okay? In but this the case, subject in the, in the first part or the subject in the second part? It doesn't matter. It depends on what you're going to say, okay? Remember that each clause is independent, right? So when you visit uh, someone, yeah. right? So, I mean, it's giving their own idea. When you visit someone, so who is supposed to give what to who? ¿Quién va a dar a qué a quién? I suppose they give me something to drink. No. Are you going to give them something to drink? They to me. I, I expect Yes, I, I, yes, exactly. I, so they expected. are expected to give <laughs> you something to drink. They, not you. Ah, they. Okay. All right. Yeah. All right. That's why okay. I say, el sujeto es quien hace el acción, right? Si ellos te van a dar a vos, Entonces empezás con they, okay? They. Okay. They are supposed to give me something to drink. They are supposed, supposed, supposed to give me to give yes me to give to, me. or to offer me, right? To offer something to, to drink. Offer. offer me something to drink. Exactly, yes. Okay. Okay. The second. The second is if you, if you, you. If How to you, say you? If you if you've been to a friend's home a for friend. dinner. Okay. You supposed to. You're. You are supposed. Bring something for the dessert. Bring something for dessert. For dessert. You are supposed to bring, uh huh. Is correct? Yes, that is correct. For dessert. Yes. Dessert with double S or one S? Um, that is, that is, uh, one S. I think, okay. hold on. Sorry. Yes. Sorry. Thank you. Actually, no, the, the, we're talking about, hold on. It's with double S, right? If you're gonna talk about uh, food, dessert. Yes, dessert. Okay. Right. dessert. Okay. When you have invite to a wedding, when you have been invited, <laughs> oh, I, th I, th I think that's there is something wrong there, isn't it? Hold on. Look at that. Matt. It should say when you have been invited. Okay. Yes. You have been invited to a wedding. Mm -hmm. You. I'm going to check on the other guys, okay? Hold on. No. Okay. Hello, everyone. Nancy, Stephanie, Ruben, are you there? 
Yes, I'm there. Okay, I'm so, so what, how are you doing? What's the answer Hola. for the first one? What do you have for the first exercise? Uh, uh, wait. If you plan to visit someone at home, you are expected to something to eat. To bring something to eat, okay? You're forgetting two plus the verb. Okay, Ruben, I'm sorry, Ruben, were you saying something? Ruben, no sé si dijiste algo, Ruben. Yes, I can say it. Oh, okay, all right, got it, got it, got it. It's hard. Cuesta entender por por la conexión que tenés. Yeah, it's hard to understand because it's uh, incapacitado. Okay, all right, sounds good. Thank you very much, Ruben. All right. So continue, guys. Work work together, guys. Work together, okay? Thanks a lot, Ruben. So what do we what do you have for number two then, uh, uh, Nancy? Oh, okay. Está incapacitado. Lo siento. Okay, sounds good, okay. Ruben. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. So uh, Nancy, is Nancy here? Se nos durmió la Nancy. All right. What do you have for number two, Stephanie? Uh, if you've been to a friend's home for dinner, you are to supposed to bring dessert. You are supposed to bring, right? Dessert. 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 Uh, dessert. All right. Yes, dessert. Okay. Nancy. All right. Welcome back, Nancy. I saw you. Don't be shy. Don't be shy, Nancy. Are you there? Right, very good. So, anyways, guys, uh, keep, all right, I need you to talk. And Nancy, I need you, Nancy, necesito que, que hables con Stephanie, okay? You're supposed to practice. It's not practical, okay? I'll be right back, guys. I am supposed, supposed to leave a good tip. Very good, okay? You're supposed to live. To leave, I'm sorry, to leave a good tip. To leave a good tip. Yeah, to leave a good yes. tip. Okay. Six. Tip. When you meet okay. someone for the first time. When you meet someone for a first time. You, you. You are supposed to be nervous. Yes. All right. You're supposed to be nervous. I like that. Okay. Finish. <laughs> All right. Now you need to do the conversation. Okay. The conversation what are you topics. To do? Okay. If I. If I go on a day for the first time, <clears throat> it's correct? Yes. If I go to a, a day for the first time, I am expected to have a good time. I am expected to have a good time. Okay. Very good. All right, guys. So uh, we're going to go back now. I think everybody took a very long time finishing the, the exercises. But we're going to go back down now so we can solve them together, OK? All right, okay. let's go, guys. All right, guys. Very good. OK, guys, so let's see. So what do you have? For number one, guys, what do you have for number one?
Oh, am I muted? No, no, I'm not muted. So what do you have for number one, guys? Who? Oh. Uh, anyone. So if you plan to visit someone at home. If you plan to visit someone at home, they are supposed to offer me something to drink. Very good, okay, good job. Jose, right? If you've been to a friend's home for dinner. <clears throat> for dinner. Uh, You are, you are supposed this. You didn't finish it? Yes. You are supposed to bring dessert. Bring okay, all right. dessert. You guys, it's dessert, not desert. Desert, guys, is desierto. ¿Cómo le vas a traer desierto para comer alguien, right? Okay, you need to work together, right? Very good. Uh, Stephanie, number three, Stephanie. When you have been invited to a wedding? I am to suppose to I am supposed, dance. I am supposed, I am supposed to dance. To dance. Very good, okay. Nancy, number four. When you go out on a date? I think that you meet it. Yeah, there you go. Okay. No, teacher, I don't know. You don't have it? No. Okay, all right. Uh, Laura, okay, let's go with when, when you go out on a date. When you uh, when you go out on a date, you're, you're expected to share the check. Okay, you're expected to share the check. Very good, okay. The check right. or, 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 or the bill? We, which is correct. The bill. The bill, okay. Yes, the bill. All right, very good. Uh, so number five, Jose. If it's a restaurant. I am supposed to leave a good fit. Very good, okay. Stephanie, number six, when you meet someone for the first time, and you are to you are supposed now uh, you are supposed to um to know the person all right very good the, okay so the, i mean that's that's grammatically correct but the idea doesn't make sense right cuando conoce a alguien por primera vez se supone que tenés que conocerlo all right, so the idea, all right, let's work on the idea, but it is grammatically correct, okay? Anyways, guys, any questions here, guys? Questions? Are we good? All right, so guys, uh, do we have any question regarding the final exam? No, todo bien, guys, con el final exam? What about section yes, five? Yes, I have already finished. Oh, thank you, Laura. Uh, any question with number section five, guys? Section cinco? No questions with no, section five no, either? No. All right. Okay. okay, so it seems that everything is fine then. So, guys, uh, I wish I had, you know, I'd had had any, uh, everybody here. But apparently, uh, I mean, I know that you guys are busy and everything. I am not sure, guys, if you're going to be with me on the next module. I hope so, you know, because you guys, you know, you guys are pretty cool. And I think that you've gotten used to my English. Creo que se acostumbraron, guys, a entenderme más cuando hablo, yes. All right. So, so, so that's good, you know. That's going to help you out a lot. Um, so, uh, lo que está diciendo, guys, right, que... Uh, no sé, si, no sé si nos vamos a ver las, bueno, las, en los siguientes módulos, guys. Espero que sí. Ok. Um, 
me agrada bastante este grupo, creo que es, es muy divertido, guys, y todos participan, y muy inteligentes, guys, entonces, solo terminen la plataforma, si no la han terminado, guys, yo sé que sí, ¿verdad? Y uh, eso es todo, guys, ¿ok? It's been really nice meeting you, y, um, and I don't know if you have anything else to say, guys, alguien? So, yes, Laura. I have a question, and no. if we are going to continue with the, the next model, we are going to start next week, or we are going to wait one week? Um, Do you know something about that? Do you know something we, we about never that? Know, we never know anything about that. They, usually, you know, we wait at least a week. Por lo menos una semana es better, right? I think, I think, okay, <laughs> all right, don't take my word for it. I we need vacation. <laughs> I think we're going to start on the 3rd. Creo que vamos a iniciar el 3 de noviembre. Creo. Right? But definitely not next week, okay? Definitivamente no la siguiente semana, okay? All right? So, okay, guys. So, guys, un placer haberlos conocido. Pero verlos, guys. Okay? Nice to meet you, too. Take care, guys. Nice meeting you all. Mucho gusto de conocerlo, profe. See you, Thank guys. You. Take care. Thank you. Thank you.